He's joined now along with Stephen Sp Stephen Spahn, Chancellor at the Dwight School in New York. First of all, Stefan, congratulations, young man. How old are you? I'm 15. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now, um, I take it that you wrote the software that goes into the 3D printer to produce this hand. Is that right? Yeah. How long did it take you to write the software? Well, I've been working on it since sixth grade, so... That's a, a long while. time. Yeah. And you perfected it? Yeah. So you create the software, run it through a 3D printer, and that is the result? Well, it prints out in different pieces, and they all have to be assembled. Okay. Now, how does it work? Uh, so basically, it works every time you open and close your hand. Uh, your muscle moves a little bit, so uh, even uh, amputees who don't have parts of their hand, they still have that muscle intact. So my sensor simply picks up on that. And oh, your sensor picks up on the muscle movement? Yeah. And then responds with a hand movement yeah. like that. Okay. Now, do you need to tailor the hand to individuals, customize it? Well, the great thing, since it's 3D printed, every single part on here can be customized to the user's needs. Okay. Um, how much? Uh, it costs $300 to make. That's it? Yeah, and most prosthetics for uh, this type of amputation can be upwards of $65,000. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> what are you going to do with this creation? I mean, it's a real good thing here. What are you going to do with it? You're going to commercialize it? Uh, well, my goal is to distribute it to uh, especially victims of war in mm -hmm. countries that don't have the great technology that we do in the United States. You're a good man, and that's a fact. Mm. Stephen, you, uh, you're the chancellor of the school that this young man attends. You shepherded all this th lot through. Is he a good student? He's a very good student. Did you have to push him, or did he work hard no, on his no, own? he works on his own. The creativity and imagination is ex it's really part of his passion. You we call it Dwight Spark of Genius, and he has it. <laughs> That's a good line. Uh -huh. Dwight Spark of Genius, and he has it. I'm out of time, regrettably. But that's really cool stuff, Stefan. Congratulations, young man. Thank you. You're one of the young inventors that we like to have on this program because you're making a mark, and that's good. Thank you. Stefan, Stephen, both of you, thanks mm -hmm. very much indeed.